see the bride? Well, then, as Kevin, Tara's brother, plays, as the music begins, ladies and gentlemen, please rise. for Tara. She comes in, everyone. So we're gathered here today to celebrate one of life's greatest moments, the joining of these two hearts. Today we're joining Levi and Tara in marriage. Now if there's anybody here who has just caused why this couple should not be united, get out. <laughs> So who gives this woman today to be married? Her mother and I. Very good. Give her. You may all be seated. <laughs> <laughs> it's a dream come true. You see, a good marriage like yours has been created. In marriage, the little things, well, they can be the big things. But it's never being too old to hold hands, just like you're doing. It's remembering to say, I love you, at least once a day. Have you said that today? Huh? <laughs> it's about time. <laughs> and it's not just marrying the right person, but it's being the right partner. And today, in front of your friends and family and a couple of Kiwanis, Look at you. You're marrying the right partner. So you ready to do this? Yep. Now, Tara and Levi are very excited that you guys are here today. And to honor everybody for being here, their wedding party would like to do a toast to you. Pass it on down. These drinks are to recognize that your being here is very important to them, that you all are a big part of this wedding. So to honor all of you, the bridal party look out at the audience and say, here's to you. Here's to you. Shoot them down. <laughs> Toss them over your shoulder. There you go. Do you promise to love me even when my snoring gets out of control? <laughs> I do. And will you promise to always be the girl that I fell in love with the moment I met you? I do. She does. And for you. <laughs> do you promise to love Tara despite her calamitous nature and always thinking that her scars are sexy? I do. <laughs> Do you promise to never change from the man you are today, snorting, snoring and all? <laughs> and do you always plan and promise to be a big fan of Tara as you are the six-time Super Bowl champion Pittsburgh Steelers? <laughs> I do. <laughs> now, the two of you have had a special day so far. Now we have to do the rings. May I have the rings, please? Jimmy, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your bride. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear it for Mr. and Mrs. Maldonado.
Okay. Well, I'll try not to cry. No, I, uh, I'll cut this sweet, short and sweet because I know there's food waiting. But uh, I remember the first time I met Levi. Well, I could not forget it. But the, <laughs> we were out in front talking and I told him, I mean, today. Uh, he has uh, made my daughter happier. I've ever seen her, and he's been with her every minute, and uh, I don't know what else to say, but uh, he knows. So I love them both, and I know he's, they're going to live and have a happy life, and whatever else comes along with it. And I'll talk more, but uh, i got a frog in my throat. <laughs> love you. Aside because we're going to bring up the other special man in her life, and that's her father, Paul. Mr. Paul Armour, where are you? Let's give it up for Paul. God bless you. This is their father, daughter dance. Life lessons you've taught me, and even though I'm now Levi's wife, just remember. 